What is up guys, it's me Bang on 911 coming at you with the trick challenge number three. Now guys, what you're watching here is our first and actual victory victorious uh submission for challenge map number two. We didn't get any submission for number one, but this guy he actually is the first one to submit a actual attempt and I launched it and it's absolutely perfect. He only messes up twice, so it still qualifies. Guys, I do hope you enjoy this. He has actually won himself sub box for a week as well as he's going to be shout out. His name is FTG Nubish X Pro. It'll be listed in the video right now. So guys, I've actually played with him a few times when I did my live streams. He's a really chill guy. He'll actually listen to you if you tell him to do things. I recommend, you know, adding him on, uh, you know, just playing some custom games and such like that. But yeah, guys, he's the first one to do it, and he set the time to beat with two minutes and two seconds on the clock. Guys, I was really impressed because uh, I kind of expected this to be way harder. But one thing I wanted to let you know is that the slide challenge portion of these maps are now done with. There's going to be no more of these slides because there's one more in challenge number three. And I realized, guys, that it's really difficult. A lot of it's very chance-based. I'm going to take it completely out, guys. But, I mean, I'm still going to use slides. I'm just not going to use the one with the curve at the end where you have to spam click A to get off of it. But, guys, I hope you enjoyed the actual run this guy did. He actually did it very paced. He slowed himself down. He made sure he stayed posed. And he kept focusing on what he was doing. And, guys, that is some of the best things and best tips that you could ever do when you're doing these challenges. Is that it's not always about trying to get it done the fastest. It's about how accurate are you. Because if you mess up, you're pretty much screwing yourself over. You do get attempts, but you got to focus on what, where can I fail if it needs to be a fail. So, guys, two minutes and two seconds. And here we go. Now, here we go, guys. Challenge number three. This is how it's going to be laid down. First thing you got to do is go on that grab lift, jump onto the turret that you see right behind me. You see it right there. Jump on those turrets, and then when you get to the third turret, you actually have the trick there. You need to take that turret, grab it, jump on top of the turret, and then jump to the platform next. Next up, you're going to get on the grab lift here. Teleport all the way over to that little platform over here. You need to land on the left side of the ledge. If you land on the right, you will slide off and fall to your death. You'll get caught by a teleporter, but it will... You, if you don't land it right, you'll get killed by a kill ball. From there, you need to jump on these platforms, jump and do a crouch jump on top of this last one. As you see, I fail horribly and miserably. But guys, be warned, there's only a little bit of space for um, failure, so if you fail it, you may fall into the kill ball. That's just a warning, guys. Here is the trickiest part of the whole entire challenge, in my opinion. From there, you need to land on these little diamond platforms. Now, there's a trick with these. You can land on them, but you need to land directly on the center, right there. If you land on the sides, you will start sliding off, as you will see right there. It doesn't work if you land on the side. Sometimes you can get away with it, but you need to land dead smack in the center. From there, you're going to keep jumping until you hit the slide. Uh, I will bring that up in a second. As you can see... Everything, like I say, all the time is possible. All these challenges, all these obstacles are 100% possible. From here now, you jump down this slide. You need to slide down, do your usual crouch jump or uh, just regular spam A jump, and then you need to land on that platform over there. Uh, I landed on the wrong one. Doesn't matter. Land on this one, jump up here onto this little platform. Now, this one you need to aim yourself because if you don't land it the first time, you may slide off or you may not even hit it at all. From there, you need to make it past that kill ball, grab a sprint, and then jump past the floating, going up and down kill ball. So, guys, this part's a little tricky. You need to time yourself perfectly. From there, you need to jump on that little antenna and then jump on this flat platform. Now, here's another trick, kiddies. I'm not going to tell you how to do it, but you need to navigate between these two walls on top of this platform. From there, you have actually completed the challenge, guys, and that is the third challenge for Trickers Challenge. Don't forget to read some likes, some comments, guys. Don't need to subscribe. Don't need a favorite, guys. But we will be back with another challenge next week. It might be delayed, so I apologize in advance if there's a delay in the time. But, guys, I do hope you enjoy these challenges, and best of luck to everybody.